Assalamu alaikum. How are you, my dear students? Hope all you are well by the grace of Almighty Allah. I am also fine. Welcome to NIEBS Home School. This is Amiruddin, Assistant Teacher of Mathematics, Morning Ship, National Ideal English Version School. Dear students, today I am going to take a math class for the students of class 3. Our today's topic short question for 1. This is lecture number 11 and SW number 9. Dear students, we have selected some short question from Enjoying Mental Math Book. Okay, this is part number 1. We will take total 3 part. Here, first question is <coughs> 15 tens plus 8 ones is equal to what? 15 tens means 15 multiplication 10 and 15 multiplication 10 is equal to 150 150 plus 8 ones 8 ones means 8 multiplication 1 this is equal to 8 and 150 plus 8 is equal to 158 so answer will be 158 Again, I am telling it 15 tens means 15 multiplication 10 plus 8 ones means 8 multiplication 1. This is equal to 150 plus 8 and this is equal to 158. I hope you have understood now it. Now, second one is the number which come after. 999 that means next number of 999 if we add 1 with 999 then we can get the number and it will be 1000 you know that the next number of 999 is 1000 so answer will be 1 0 0 and 0 now third one the smallest four digits number is smallest four digit number in highest place we have to put smallest significant digit and other place we have to put zero you know that one is the smallest significant digit so in highest place that means in a thousandth place we have to put one and another place we have to put zero zero and zero that means smallest four digit number is 1000 now four number the greatest three digits number is greatest three digits number so highest place is hundredth place three digits greatest so in every place we have to put greatest digit you know that greatest digit is nine so in three place that means in hundred place in tens place and in ones place we have to put nine then we can get greatest three digit number so it will be nine nine and nine that means 999 now 65 plus 43 minus 8 is equal to what at first we will add 65 with 43 65 plus 43 this is equal to 5 plus 3 is equal to 8 5 plus 3 is equal to 8 and 6 plus 4 is equal to 10 108 108 minus 8 is equal to 100 so answer will be 100 next one expand 2705 here 2 is in thousands place 7 is in hundreds place and 5 is in ones place so in thousands place we will write 2 and in h means 100 in hundreds place 7 exists so here we will write 7 o means ones place in ones place 5 exists so we have to write 5 here now 7 number Write the largest four digit number with uh, digits 1079. We have to write largest four digit number and at the time of writing the number, 
we have to use uh, these uh, given digits so since we have to write a largest number so largest digit have to write in largest place here it is four digit number so largest place is thousands place so in thousands place we have to put largest digit nine now second largest digit is seven which have to write in next place that means in hundred place have to write seven now one have to write in tens place and zero is in ones place this is largest four digit number using this digit nine thousand seven hundred ten now eight number how many fives are there in 60 how many fives are there in 60 that means how many if we add how many five then we can get 60 5 plus 5 plus 5 plus 5 plus dot 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 plus 5 is equal to 60 in such way we have to add how many 5 for getting 60 here if we divide 60 by 5 then we can get easily if we divide 60 by 5 then 5 12 are 60 that means if we add total 12 5 then we can get 60 so answer will be 12 if we divide 60 by 12 uh, 60 by 5 then in 6 we can get we can give one time then 6 minus 5 is equal to 1 have to take 0 in 10 we can give two times quotient 12 so answer will be 12 now 9 number <coughs> Four sets of ten is equal to five sets of what? Four sets of ten means uh, four tens are forty, and forty equal to five sets of what? Five sets of five eights are forty. So we have to write eight here. We know that four sets of ten. Four sets of ten means four multiplication ten, and four multiplication ten is equal to four tens are forty. Now, 5 sets of what? 5 eights are 40, we know that. So, we have to write 8 here. Now, 10 number. How many paisa are there in rupee 5? You know that 1 rupee is equal to 100 paisa. So, 5 rupee is equal to 500 paisa. Very easy. 500 PS. Now, 11 number. Taking away 10 pipes from 2150. Taking away means subtraction. We have to subtract 10 pipes from 2150. 10 pipes means 5 multiplication 10, and 5 multiplication 10 is equal to 50. That means we have to subtract 50 from 2150 if we subtract 50 from what 2150 5 tens means 50 and this is equal to 2100 so answer will be 2100 now 12 number how many dozens are there in 72 that means how many dozens make can make 72 you know that one dozen is equal to 12 things that means how many 12 things can make 72 that means we have to add how many 12s for getting 72 if we divide 72 by 12 then we can get it 12 by 72, 12 1s are 12, 12 2s are 24, 12 3s are 36, 12 4s are 48, 12 5s are 60 and 12 6 are, 12 6 are 72, so answer will be 6. Now, 13 number, 
45 multiplication 0 multiplication 100 equal to what here 0 exists you know that if we multiply 0 by any number answer will be 0 so here answer is 0 now 14 number the predecessors of 6000 predecessor means previous number previous number of 6000 if we subtract 1 from 6000 then we can get it you know that previous number of 6000 is 5999 so answer will be 5999 now 15 number Ananda's birthday is five days after the Independence Day. When is his birthday? You know that Independence Day is 26 March is Independence Day. 26 March. So five days after 26 March. After 26 if we take five days then it should be 27 28 29 30 and march must is 6 31 days so we can get we can take 31 also one two three four five so five days after 26 it will be 31 march 31 march Dear the students, we have finished our today's class. I hope you have understood today's class. Do your SW properly. Submit on next Saturday. At the time of writing SW, you must have to write the question, then have to write answer. Okay? Stay home, stay safe, obey your parents' order. Thank you for watching the class. Allah Hafiz.